All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Stone Ocean episode eight. Um, getting through these episodes now. Uh, we are close to the ending. Uh, three, one, two, three, four, four more episodes. My maths is amazing uh, to go now. Uh, I'm very much looking forward to seeing where we where we're kind of going to go from here. Obviously, uh, the way it's kind of working with the batch releases, it's it's not kind of an ending of a season. Say this is all you know one season. Um, so it's going to be interesting to see where it kind of ends off on the first batch of episodes. Um, but yeah, anyway guys, like the video if you like the video and subscribe to the channel if you are new. And let's go right into this episode right now. Achiro. Oh, was that the girl's name? I mean, some, pe some faces here are, should be fairly memorable. What does that mean, huh? Oh, shit. I actually did notice that. Yeah, right there. I was wondering what happened there. Oh, shit. Okay. I, when did you punch her in the face? Bro, I have no idea who the bad guy is. Or was she just testing exactly what I said in the last episode? Yeah, and whichever one can see the stand. Wait, she was holding back her fist. Wait, what? Is it both of them? It's all of them? What the hell is going on? Oh no, it's like possess them. Ugh, gross. Ugh, this is so gross. Ah. Oh my god, this stand is crazy. Ugh, gross. They're all corpses, they're literally all dead. You protect yourself. Speaking like it's the stand is is it a sentient stand? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it's a sentient stand. Or it was. I don't get it. It was an organism of some kind that was given the discs. What they give the disc to some plankton or something? Like what the hell is this? Where the hell did this thing come from? I don't get it. Did it just appear? <laughs> Foo Fighters FF. Bro, they could have done so much better with that. Just born simultaneously on Earth. Are you saying that you're older than the Big Bang? Well, yeah, fair enough. Like, plants and trees and shit have intellect too. Look at the way it runs. So this thing is literally plankton that was given a stand, basically. What the hell? It's got another part to it. You need to chop off this guard's arm. You need to do something fast and not just talk about it. Bro, she's got trust in Hermes. Jolene, you are crazy. You need to fight this stand. Materialize your stand, come on. Yes. Oh shit, your stand isn't very strong. Oh no. Uh. Ow. Bro, this dude's gotta be heavy. Oh shit. Come on, Emmys. Come on. Oh. Oh, dust everywhere. <laughs> Lovely corpse dust. Nice. 
don't don't breathe that in. <laughs> Good share, Amis. Yeah, running. Bro, these girls have known each other for like a week. Max. And they're already like best bros. How are you going to beat this thing, Jolene? Come on. This thing is like hella intelligent. This There could be some bargaining done, done here. And it's strong if it can lift a tractor tire. Jesus. Oh shit, come on, Jolene. She's a Joe star. She's got a plan for this. Oh god, he's sucking the moisture out. Oh no. Oh really? How is that tractor going? <laughs> Look at it go. But Emmys is getting further away too. You're running on dirt. There's no there's not gonna be moisture here. Ah, oh, you fucked yourself. Oh, you're literally getting drained. <laughs> oh, you're just gonna kill it? Oh? This thing's intelligent. I think we can bargain with it. Exactly. Ah, okay. So this thing can live then. I think it'd be a good ally to have, to be honest. That's a good point, actually. It literally only just came into existence, so... Yeah, it doesn't un understand the concept of killing people being evil. Oh. Hey, this is a better boss than Whitesnake. Yeah, this thing's intelligent. This is definitely a good ally to have. Ooh, fighters. Now oh, you just gotta figure out which is which. That was easy. Are you, are you putting Star Platinum in yourself? Bro, that's so cool. No, but your body doesn't like it, even if you are a Joe Star. Bro, that would be so cool if she could use Star Platinum to stand. What the fuck? This is Boo Fighters? This girl's body exploded, what the fuck? Ugh. So you put her back together? Oh. Cool. So, Foo Fighters the stand gets put in a new waifu. That's awesome. <laughs> What? This girl? Okay, apparently the, the bullied, like, quiet, nice-looking ones are not nice at all. What the fuck? Oh, well, thank you. Whoa! <laughs> you little freak, go away. <laughs> this thing's so weird. Oh my god, having this thing right under is going to be hilarious. Mm, yes, this is how you drink from cup. Ah, so that's why... That's likely why then Jotaro's memories aren't here. His memory? What's in his memory? I mean, a lot of shit, but like... What specifically? How are you going to do that, though? Like, these guards are going to come search you as soon as they get here. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh! <laughs> okay! This is technically a corpse, but... Alright. I wonder if they'll get, like... Rewards for saving this card. 
Uh, maybe. Who knows? Wait, is he speaking to the stand? Oh shit, is this the user? Father Pucci. Oh. He looks cool. Alright, so that was Jojo episode 8. Episode 8? Eight, episode 8. Um, yeah, really wacky fun episode. We now have Foo Fighters on the squad, which was very surprising, interesting. Uh, sentient stand, but very kind of intelligent uh, and obviously willing to kind of bargain. Um, obviously, it just came into existence, so we it kind of gone over a few things such as kind of, you know, killing people and why that's wrong or why that's evil, but it didn't really understand the concept of evil, but now it's learning. Um, and then it came back as this girl who exploded in, into a million pieces, which is weird that it's now just walking out in a flesh, walking around in a flesh suit, basically. Um, but yeah, you know, she's part of the squad now. That's pretty cool. Uh, I guess it's a, it's it's just an organism. It didn't really have a gender. But while it's in, you know, um, this girl's body, I'll just say she. Um, but yeah, overall, very good episode. Oh, and then we saw the stand user for White Snake, uh, Pucci. Or Father Pucci seems to be a, well, a priest, I guess. Um, yeah, very cool. And obviously, the way the guard was speaking to him, he clearly isn't a prisoner. Um, so he must be one of the staff at the prison. Uh, yeah, overall, a very good episode. And I'm definitely looking forward to the next. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I certainly did. And I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have an interesting day and peace out.